Testing is one of the benchmarks to fully reopening the state of Georgia. And while state officials promote the availability of testing in every county, not everybody has the ability to reach those testing sites. Matt Pearl takes us inside Georgia's testing gap. This is how it is, or how it was, at the busiest clinic in what's called the most diverse square mile in America. 51% of the population are refugees or recent immigrants. You see about 150 to 160 patients per week. Saeed Reis runs the Clarkston Community Health Center. For seven years, it's treated uninsured patients from underserved groups with an all-volunteer staff. This footage is from February, one month before COVID-19 threatened to cut its services. We shut down the clinic, but you know, a lot of people who lost their job, they also lost their health care coverage. And so there is a big need. They shut it down for two weeks, but volunteers kept volunteering, patients kept calling, and the clinic received free services from a company that provides telemedicine. Now, this is how it is. The clinic provides seven days a week of teleappointments and COVID-19 testing every weekend. We started last Saturday and we are able to offer for free testing to anybody and everybody who walks in. Some services don't work through a phone, but this busiest clinic in this diverse square mile is now even busier, a sign of how vital it has become. They don't have transportation. They are scared of the system. We treat them because, you know, we feel healthcare is a right of every human. And that care is so vital right now, especially all those volunteer hours that went into it. And Matt, you also mentioned about the telemedicine and the donation that made that possible. It's a company called ExamMed. It's a local company actually based out of Cobb County. And the CEO told me today that they've been giving out their telehealth software to anyone who needs it for 90 days for free. And in this case, they decided to make an exception and donate it permanently. Matt, thanks. We posted links to help you find a coronavirus testing location closest to you. It's on our 11 Live app. You'll also find information on what you need to get tested.